okay, fuck, this is free. Um, but of course, most people pick them up and they probably, uh, yeah, do what, the, do what the supermarket wants you to do and buy the products, read about the products and then purchase them. And the kind of people that read these magazines and use them are indeed certain types of people, common people, uh, so-called normal people. I'm going to just leave that. Normal people tend to be really gullible. I know that sounds a bit silly, but they are. They don't seem to um, have any ability to make their own decisions. They get they get the decisions made for them by corporations, and uh, they tend to just follow the leader, which yeah, is the corporations, the people trying to sell the product, peddle the product. Uh, and they don't seem to have any ability to think outside the box and they, they get gulled into having to, thinking they need the product when, hey, they don't, or they may not, but they don't, or they don't need it much, but they think they need it because the marketing and advertising dictates. And let's see what it is. It is health and beauty, and a lot of people, especially women, really think that they need these health and so-called health and beauty products and the, i don't know if that belongs but this is you know this kind of makeup shit because most so most mostly women but women typically feel they have to wear makeup and that's why they get they get they buy all this shit and this is it what we're interested in so they, they're the ones that are easy to market to yeah you know, they preach and they preach and they preach their products and their services and people typical people normal average people typically think they need makeup i don't wear makeup folks i'm not a makeup person see my face not a fucking piece of makeup whatsoever and i don't need it i don't want it i've got no liking for it uh i wear a mask in public so i don't want stuff rubbing off all over my mask and all over my face in un unwanted areas so what's the point? I don't wear, I don't wear, even without a mask, I wouldn't wear it. To me, makeup is silly. It's come up looking really quite a treat, actually. Maybe we could change the, maybe we'll use this as our master copy and we'll make it into a movement piece. But people are just so fucking gullible. They just don't, they just can't think outside the, the marketing box they think that they have to be that they need the product they need the service just because they've been preached it's like a it's like a form of religion folks they the people who run the corporations or the or should i say the marketers or the advertisers they preach oh of course the corporation is like a deity or a god and the, the um, advertising is basically like preachers like religion so if you don't like religion why do you fucking go with this shit you know if you don't like religion folks you don't like having religion forced down your throat why do you let these marketeers and advertisers do the same with product you know there's nothing useful with this kind of religion i don't like this kind of religion so yeah you just it's just silly the way people fall for this crap. And it is, it's crap. It's just junk. Who needs makeup? Who really needs makeup? It's it's real. There's a real sense of freedom when you don't need to put on your face, as a lot of typically old women like to say. I've had people say that. I've seen, heard people say, oh, I've got to put on my face. It's like, what? They've been brainwashed by this religion of money. The love of money is a religion, folks. If you don't like religion, why do you follow this one? You know, if you don't like fucking religion, folks, why follow this one? You're gullible. You know, you're fucking gullible and stupid if you think that this religion's going to bring you something good. You know, honestly, folks, I have no time for this crap. I don't follow it. I don't believe in it. I'm not a believer. I, when it comes to marketing and 
advertising, I'm basically an unbeliever. I'm a heathen. <laughs> I don't need this shit, folks. I don't need it. I really don't. I'm not interested in being preached to. I'm not interested in being brainwashed. If people want to buy this tartary, it is silly. It's really dumb, really stupid, this makeup. You know, needing, feeling you have to put on your face in order to face the world. That's pretty, gull pretty gullible and cowardly to think that. To think that you have to wear a, an artificial product to make yourself beautiful. And, you know, and, and you think you're sexy because you're putting on eyeliner or you're making yourself look like a fucking painted up little tart. You know, you look like a tart in, when you when you put that shit on. It, it makes you look like a fucking tart. You don't look fucking natural. You don't look attractive. No, sorry. I'm sorry to say that, folks. Sorry to block, to pop your bubble, your beauty bubble. You know, honestly, I have no, I have no respect for beauty, health and beauty, as they like to call it. I don't know. I don't like it. But I know that a lot of people are just so hooked up on it, they just can't resist tinkering with their features and getting other more drastic things like Botox or uh, boob jobs and all that sort of stuff, all in the name of this vain thing called beauty. It is, it's vain. It's very vain, folks. Don't, make no fucking mistake, it's vain. This is all shitty van vanity. This is all vanity shit. You know, vanity. If you can't face the world without makeup, well, what's the point? It, it, it's just silly. Just think of all the money you'll save if you don't buy into this shit. This has come up looking at treat. I think we'll use that one as our master copy now. Yeah, you're just, you're just buying into this bullshit. They just want to make money out of you, folks. They just want to make money. That's all it is, folks. Money fuckery. Why are you giving money fuckers any kind? It's religion. Money and... That's the religion, folks. Money. The love of money is religion. It is a kind of religion. Make no fucking dumb, dumb mistake. You know, don't follow it, folks. Just ignore it. Give it the middle finger. Give it the flick. Show the world that you don't need this shit. You don't need to be dictated to, preached by the high priests of the love of money. You can think for yourselves. You don't need other people to tell you and to put things in your head. And there's something wrong with this machine. Uh, this machine is getting old. And I, then the photocopier industry in itself also wants you to buy a product. Again, they're like a religion, but the problem with this is I need a photocopier. It's a need. It's a necessity. Makeup isn't. Um... Well, of course, maybe if you have a, a serious um, deformity on your face that must be covered up because it really is quite confronting, well, maybe that's, that's the only case, one of the few cases you have for wearing makeup. Um, but basically, apart from that, it's just vanity. It's just a waste of money and you're just submitting to the high priests of the love of money. You don't want to do that, folks. you got to show them you can think for yourselves. you got to show them that you are in charge, that you are not going to be dictated to. You're not going to be told what to do and how to do it, how to wear it, you know, to wear makeup and how to wear it, to be so-called fashionistas, to be in tr on trend. Who needs to be on fucking trend? Off trend is what it should be. Tre and this phrase, on trend, is so stupid. It's like anything to do with trends and fashion and all that and everything that's fleeting. It's just a load of shit. Can't you see that, folks? Can't you fucking see that? Are you fucking that dumb and gullible? You fucking idiots who wear makeup? Oh, fuck me dead. Honestly. The religion, I want to commit sacrilege against the love of money. I want to smash the idols that these people have. I want to smash some fucking idols, some fucking things that this religion is teaching. This is not 
this is not what religion, this is a really bad religion, folks, really bad. And you seem to think you need it. And you've probably got lots of money yourself. And you don't, you want to spend it, and you want to spend it on crap. Why don't you give to charity for fuck's sake? You know, help less fortunate people instead of fucking playing, tinkering with your features. Tinkering and playing around and trying to make yourself look more tarty, tarty, tarty and ugly. Ugly, folks. Ugly. That's what makeup is. Ugly. The makeup industry is ugly. And that's come up looking really quite a treat. A bit curly, but I think we can now call this demo quits.